I think one of the most respectable things I found for you from you was the fact that you did a project called the A Thousand Scenes Project, which right. I think is <laughs> it's maniacal. <laughs> That's <laughs> accurate, yes. What is the purpose of this project? What was, it, what was the idea behind this thing? Like a lot of things, uh, I, think for, I think this is true for everybody. I've uh, definitely found it true for me. Uh, in retrospect, there were good reasons to do it, but my <laughs> reasons for doing it were very dumb and not thought out at all. 2015 uh, was when I did the 1000 Scenes Project. Uh, and... I, the year before, uh, 2014, I realized it was uh, my 20-year improv anniversary from when I auditioned uh, junior year and got into the got into uh, okay, my college sure. improv group. So I was like, well, 20 years, that's, that, that's a long time. I want to do some sort of project to commemorate 20 years of improv. It feels like I need to celebrate it in some way. So I'll do some sort of project. And maybe I'll start uh, January 1st, 2015 and do some sort of thing. And so I was trying to figure out what I wanted to do. Who would I collaborate with? And I started to see, I, I was sort of looking on, I guess on Facebook, like who do I, who have I met over the years that I want to do scenes with or do some sort of improv project mm -hmm. with or some sort of thing with. And I realized I know so oh, many improvisers. <laughs> I know, I know way more than a thousand improvisers. I probably know like three or 4,000 improvisers. And by no, I mean, have worked with at some point. Right. So I'd met, I'd met literally thousands of improvisers. So I thought, oh, well, you know, I'll set the bar low. Like I'll just do scenes with a thousand of, of the people that I've <laughs> met doing improv uh, over the course of a year. Uh, and I can't do it with them in person, but hey, here's this comparatively new thing, right. uh, video chatting. I was using Google Hangouts at the time. Uh, I'll do... 1,000 scenes, scenes with 1,000 different improvisers I know over Google Hangouts, and I'll give myself the whole year to do it. Uh, and I didn't really do the math. Uh, it's obviously, <laughs> when you think about 1,000 within a year, that's around three a day, a little less than three a day. And the, the logistics of it didn't really, I didn't really think it through that, you know, multiply the, the flakiness of one person time <laughs> and the difficulty of getting like scheduling a time to do something with people. Also, it didn't occur to me, some people don't want to do an improv scene online. So whereas I, I probably at the time knew at least 3000 improvisers let's say uh i had a re i had real trouble finding enough people to do it so what it ended up being was just sort of putting the word out there hey anybody who wants to do an improv scene with me online this year let's do it i'm trying to get to a thousand scenes so i did a lot of scenes with people i knew or had met once or had known for years and then a lot of scenes probably at least half of them if not more with people who i had never met before mm -hmm. uh often who i had no idea whether they'd ever done improv before um i did an improv scene with a child i did an improv scene <laughs> with a, a dog uh i did an improv scene with one of my high school math teachers, Matt, I had mentioned math earlier, so it all comes, <laughs> comes full circle, who just, anybody who reached out to me and said, I'd like to do a scene, we did a scene. Several times during the year, during 2015, I thought I wasn't gonna make it, but thanks to other people putting out the word and kind of forcing their friends to do it, <laughs> I ended up doing more than a thousand online improvised scenes in a year. But there was, there was no thought to it, to put into it, other than I wanna do something big to celebrate 20 years of improv. Mm. In retrospect, it probably did, make me a better improviser doing so many scenes but also being able to watch them afterwards and see there's lots of them that are just not very good <laughs> and the vast majority of those i would say that's it was probably my fault <laughs> uh, some of them were not my fault sometimes the, I, I did a few scenes i won't call anybody out but there are a few scenes where it was, the people were it turned out to be monsters uh <laughs> And it's just fun watching them now because it's like, oh, seeing myself have to right. deal with That's that. why I'm but laughing. 